Give him a bottle. <gasps> Fair exchange. <laughs> Just give him a bottle. Well, the wife sale is an actual historical fact that few people know about. It's something that we don't teach in school. It's a commoner's way of divorce. Um, if you uh, go and Google, if you go into a computer, um, you can find documents as early as 1604 uh, that document the sale of wives. Now, in England, divorce with Henry VIII was acceptable, but only the rich could afford it. The common people, to, to um, free themselves of undesirable situations, uh, devised a method that was outlawed from the beginning by the government, but of using sales, and they followed the same lines as cattle sales. So the woman was uh, considered the possession of the man. Um, in, in this instance, I failed to explain it, but I, I was tied with rope, and that is the possession of the man. So he would take her around shouting her virtues. In my case, I was shouting my own virtues because there are accounts of women who put them up for themselves up for the sale to get rid of a bad husband and to find a better life. Uh, oftentimes women could sell themselves as a wife or as a servant. Indentured meant seven years. It was a contract. And after seven years they gained their freedom. So you had wives or young women or um, even convicts who were sold into indentured service as a servant or as a wife for a seven year period. And this was pretty, pretty common. Offer me something nice. So the kids don't come? The kids don't come. Don't count on them. No. Oh, I don't want to count on them. Okay. I just want quiet. <laughs> if you're a good boy, you'll have you quiet, won't get yes. Quiet there. <laughs> I'm starting to get nervous. <laughs>